let us create the database once again so already we have created it and then we have dropped it but let me create again suppose if i write create database emp there is no emp database here so it will execute and here you can see the database emp here okay so let us refresh this schema here and now you can see you got a new database called emp now just think about one second like if i rerun this cell again if i rerun this create database emp what will happen so if i run this again because already emp database is created and if i rerun again so here you can see you got a cancel symbol here and you got an error code here can't create a database because database is already exist so if you are working on a real time where you have many many databases here so if we don't know whether that database is present or not so for that we simply write here create database if not exist we say create database if not exist exist and now if you run this it will not throw you an error instead it will yeah we did not get an error but it is showing you that one row is affected and can't create a database because database is already exist so this if not exist will take care of like you will not get an error but if the database is already created it will not create again so if i want to create a new database with an employee so i'll write create database if not exist em employee okay so now i know that there is no employee database created so let me run this uh, if the employee database is not created then it will create or if it is not exist then it will create otherwise it will not create so now it has executed now you can see that an employee database is created let me refresh now you can see our employee database is created so this is how we can use if not exist and then give a database name